guys, today I'll be making rib eye steak with mashed potatoes, mushrooms, and our special guest, sweet corn. Let's start cooking. Guys, I love my hair. My hair is so beautiful. Sorry to say it, but actually I'm proud of myself doing my hair by myself. Okay, I start with my potatoes. Water. Potatoes and water. You can put a tiny bit of salt inside. Like I said, you need to be careful when you put salt. Put salt, little bit of salt. I like using sea salt. boiling my corn yeah and a little bit of salt also again in my corn so just to tell you quick about my corn it's uh, I love boiling my corn first then fry it if you try this at home you will forever love eating corn Fry it with a little bit of salted butter and you will love it. Like to fry it, you're not gonna fry it until it becomes very like brown, 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 but just to get the colored, you know, in the butter. It tastes completely different. Anytime I'm eating my corn, I always like boiling it first, then I fry it, then I get the perfect corn. Okay. I will be frying my mushrooms also. I like putting pepper inside, little bit of salt, and salted butter inside. When I mean by little bit of salt, everything balanced inside. Don't get it wrong. There is no too much salt inside it. I've doing this for like God no millions times now. So a little bit of salted butter. To fry it My ribeye steaks are looking so fresh, red like a tomatoes. Looks like everything is doing their thing. Don't forget to put garlic on your steak, but don't just smash it, but just leave it in the pieces the way they are inside and leave it there. It gives the flavor and inside the steak, it make it uh, more yummy in fact. Let's check 
check how it's packed out. Oh, looking good. Yeah. So guys, try to make the garlic to be on the midst of the steak because then it get the flavor get into the steak and they get to cook inside. Look at that, looking, my mushroom is looking great, my corn is cooking well. Ready. Then time to fry my corn, my special guest corn. getting ready my corn is done you just need to get some color that's it hi guys just want to remind you not to forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to turn on your notifications to never miss a new all sorts video Potatoes. We're gonna start matching now, matching home. Two different type of potatoes. Normal potatoes and sweet potatoes. These two combination together, they taste perfect. They actually complete each other. Put your butter inside. I mean, you can always put as many as you want, but I do not need much. Normally, you put these two small pieces of it. Sorry, I don't measure it so because for me, I'm just doing things the way I feel like doing it actually. So, yeah, put as many as you can eat. Otherwise, for me, tiny bit, it's fine two small pieces of butter perfect and milk put as you want as many you want or how you want it to be okay make your food according to the way you want it to taste how you want it to be ready yeah finish finish cooking corn corn is ready 
so now in my much potatoes i love putting milkmaid inside and pepper so yeah looking good and we almost done here something it's so yummy this is takeaway i could eat this million times without getting tired of it so guys see you next time love you all